for any help in dermatology just in the youtube type drmsd followed by the dermatology topic which you want in detailed explanation so this is our today's question 5 year old boy is diagnosed with staphylococcal scalded skin syndrome vesiculation in this disease is secondary to exfoliative toxins binding which target protein and if you have marked the answer as option a that is desmoglein a you are absolutely right and if in case you are basics are very strong then i hope you do remember that in staphylococcal scarlet skin syndrome apart from pemphigus vulgaris pemphigus foliaceus there is going to be a process which is called as primary acantholysis primary acantholysis so basically what this means is there are going to be antibodies or like here exfoliative toxins which are going to target the desmoglenes and because of which the connection between the adjacent keratinocytes will be lost and the cells the keratinocytes will become separated from each other which is going to produce a separation in the epidermis which is uh, clinically going to be uh, seen as vesiculation okay and in the case of this bacterial uh, related condition staphylococcal scarlet skin syndrome the exfoliative toxins i hope do you all remember exfoliative toxin a and exfoliative toxin b are responsible for damaging and destroying the desmoglein 1 so let us see the other options as well bullus pemphigoid antigen 1 and bullus pemphigoid antigen 2 both of them will have antibodies in the case of bullus pemphigoid and desmoglein 3 desmoglein 3 it is mainly present in the mucosa mucosa and desmoglein 3 and desmoglein 1 both are going to have auto antibodies in pemphigus vulgaris and i hope you all do remember that there are certain conditions in which desmoglein 3 is not involved and the first one is of course staphylococcal scarlet skin syndrome s s s s and the other one is pemphigus foliaceus in these two desmoglein 3 is not affected and also one more question to all of you which bacterial infection you are going to see the causative organism as staphylococcus aureus and it will cause a damage to the desmoglein 1 because of which there is going to be bullous lesions in the skin so if you know the answer for this question leave your answer in the comment section below so these are the students who marked the answer right very good and here are the students in from telegram and if you like this video please do hit that like button friends so that this will boost uh, boost my morale to make more of these kind of videos in the future and you can jo join my telegram group the links are there in the description and if you know the answer for this question pause this video and type 422 forward by your answer in the comment section below you can follow me on instagram also thank you so much for watching this video till this point happy learning myself dr madhuri shinmukh sarvam shri krishna pranam sarve jana sukhina bhavantu thank you so much